Hi guys, welcome to this tutorial. In this session, we're going to solve a question from a topic, the Earth as a sphere. So we have P, Q, R and V are four points on the surface of the Earth. P, R is the diameter of the parallel of latitude of 53 degrees north. We are told to state the location of R for A and then for B we need to calculate the shortest distance in nautical miles from P to R. So let's start with filling in the information that we have. P is at 53 degrees north, 84 degrees west. So 53 degrees north, how do we put that in? Well, we start from the equator, so equator is our zero. North is going from that point upwards, south is that way. So our zero is here. We need to measure 53 degrees. You don't, to, you don't need to physically measure, but you need to just know where it is. So from there to there is 53 degrees. So what do we do? We then draw our small circle. Okay, so let's say that's where it is. 53 degrees north, that means we also have 53 degrees on that side. This latitude is at 53 degrees north. It's the same uh, thing on this side, 53 degrees north. So we've got in our latitude so far, we need to go in and draw our longitude, which is 84 degrees west. Now, how do we do that? Well, the prime meridian, which goes from north to south, is our zero degrees. So west is going left and east is going to the right we need 84 degrees so zero degrees to 84 degrees west so let's say this is our longitude so this is 84 degrees west we don't really need the q at this point so i'm just going to leave the q for now now point p is going to be where the latitude and the longitude intersect so this is our point p we're then told pr is a diameter of the parallel of latitude of 53 degrees so that is our red small circle now if this is point p so if we draw a diameter from there to there that is where point r is going to be so what will be the position of r then well, if we're going to have a diameter, that means we have a semicircle, which is what? That means from point P to R is 180 degrees. So let's see what we have. If we draw a line and we have our prime meridian, which is zero degrees, this is west and this is east. Now point P is somewhere here. Point R is somewhere there. Right, from from our prime meridian, we need to go 84 degrees west. So that means from there to there, that's 84 degrees. Now, to go from P to R, because it's a diameter, we need 180 degrees. That means from P to R, we need to travel 180 degrees. So what is the difference what is the position of R? Remember, the position is stated from the prime meridian. So from the prime meridian to the point R, we're going to take 180 degrees, take away 84 degrees. So for R then, it's going to be 96 degrees east. So from there to there, this is going to be 96 degrees east. So the location of R, so the location of R is the latitude first, which we know is on the same latitude, 53 degrees north. 
and the longitude is 96 degrees east so that is part a complete and now for part b we're asked to calculate the shortest distance in nautical miles from p to r measured along the surface of the earth so again p to r is there that's the diameter then we have 53 degrees that's a position of our latitude and what's the angle here between these uh, two angles here well we know that's 180 take away 53 take away 53 so this angle here is going to be 74 degrees how do we calculate the shortest distance well the shortest distance on the surface of the earth is going through the poles in this case we need to go through the north pole so if you imagine if i draw this going to the other side of the earth now you can see i have this so i'm going to draw it as it looks so i have this that's the center of the earth and then i have this arc that's the surface of the earth this is the radius of the earth radius of the earth and this angle here is 74 degrees so the distance from p to r in nautical miles is going to be equal to 60 minutes times 74 degrees which is going to be equal to 4,440 nautical miles. So thank you for watching and please remember to like and subscribe. Bye for now.